The sister of North Korean leader Kim Jong-un has warned of a new response against the South if it continues loudspeaker broadcasts and leaflet scattering over their shared border. In a statement carried by Pyongyang's state news agency on Sunday, Kim Yo-jong said that the South, quote, will undoubtedly witness a new counteraction of the Democratic People's Republic of Korea using the North's official name. The South's military said on Sunday it had switched the loudspeakers directed at the North back on, releasing footage of soldiers being trained to use them. It was a follow-through after Pyongyang ignored its warnings about sending more balloons carrying trash towards the South the day before. Kim said of the South's fresh broadcasts, quote, This is a prelude to a very dangerous situation. On Monday, South Korea's Joint Chiefs of Staff said it had detected signs that the North was installing its own loudspeakers. It added the South was not planning to operate its speakers that day, believed to be covered by the green wall seen in this video at the inter-Korean border. The South had not broadcast over the speakers since 2018 under a deal signed by the two Korea's leaders. The broadcasts usually include world news, information about democracy and a mix of K-pop music, and the sound is believed to travel a little over 12 miles into the North. As tensions grow on the Korean peninsula, Seoul officials said South Korea and the United States were holding talks on Monday in the South's capital on better coordinating an allied nuclear response should a war break out with Pyongyang. Meanwhile, Russian media are reporting plans by President Vladimir Putin to visit North Korea in the coming weeks. The Kremlin has stepped up ties with Pyongyang and other countries hostile to the U.S. since the start of the Ukraine war.